Hello everyone, I'm going to do a review on this drop and shock proof case for tablets. This is for an 11 inch Samsung Tab S7 and Tab S8. So here's everything that comes in the, the bag. This bag here has like the strap and this has a really big handle. Wow. I was not expecting it to be that big, but it's very sturdy. And you can just turn it. That's just like a little um, piece of elastic there for a loop. But it kind of stays wherever you turn it. It does stay. And then I can position this kind of infinite. Definitely got a detent there, but I could go infinite. Okay, so it does come with a product installation manual. So it looks like it's got a very nice manual. There definitely are some do's and don'ts on how to install it. It does come with this little tool here. This is what the strap looks like. It's got these like quick disconnects on it. Okay, so I've got my Samsung 11 inch tablet and I'm gonna try to install it in this. Okay, so step one is we wanna remove this like outer ring right here. And you got to undo these clips. So the best way is to kind of just pull it towards you and that kind of releases them. There, the whole piece just came off. Step two is this silicone. You're going to take this silicone off now. Very intricate how this is on here. Now you're left with just this plastic piece in the handle. Okay, so now there's this big slot and on your tablet you've got this where the where the pin is going to charge and there's your camera lenses. So you're going to put those in there like it says to line up the camera lenses. And it does, yeah, it kind of snaps in there and it looks like this. Now it's not being held in there. Okay, so the tablet's just kind of sitting in there. Now you've got to reinstall this rubber piece all the way around the tablet. But make sure you line up where the camera lens is. Yeah, so the camera lens is there. So see how it's got that big opening? This is gonna go right here. Okay, so getting that rubber piece on, that wasn't too bad. There's just a, like a lot of little holes. You gotta make sure you've got room for these. And it, it wasn't too bad, just kind of making sure it form fits in there. There's some pieces back here around here that you gotta kinda get back in those little grooves there. Okay, next I want you to take the frame and kind of line up the frame with there's the camera lens and you're going to snap this on now. These pieces kind of just snap on and you're just going to kind of follow that all the way around, snapping those on. Okay, that wasn't too bad actually. Okay, so the tablet's in there. That wasn't too bad. Again, that's a very big hab handle. Your definitely your tablet's not going to fall out. There's no screen. You, this is the screen of the tablet. So I know some of these have got like screen protectors, but this you're actually using the screen. It's very well protected. These these corners are very well protected. To charge it, you've got this opening like this. There's an opening for the speakers around the back. You're going to be able, still be able to slide your um, S Pen in right here to charge it. It's got a nice big opening for the power button right there and the volume buttons work. So the main reason I got this, I wanted to be able to just grab my tablet and stand it up so that I could show somebody something on the tablet. And this has got a very sturdy stand. You know, I can write on it. It, it will collapse a little bit. But for the most part, it's pretty sturdy. It's very, it keeps it very stable, and even like this. So for the straps, it shows inserting this through this little hole right here. And that be, might be, yeah, that's what this tool helps with. This tool helps with getting this through this little hole right there, like that. And so once you got it through the hole, you can undo this disconnect right here, feed it through itself, and now, 
Now you've got one side that is secure. This strap's not a bad idea. I saw a picture of this thing on the back uh, seat of a vehicle so kids could watch a, a, a show and it was just hanging on the back on the armrest or the headrest of the passenger and then the, you know the somebody could watch it a uh, video right behind them that was kind of neat so here's some pictures they show that hook for like if you want to just hang it up on a hook or if you want to put that strap around somebody's neck so again yeah this is a big hook and if I do put it on back you know there is a nice big hook like that but if I fold it onto itself, then it's kind of, now it is kind of thick when this handle is on there. So for viewing, it doesn't add a ton of weight to it. I mean, I was expecting this thing to be pretty heavy, but it's not super heavy. But this thing just works really well. I like that part. And it just makes for a nice stand and a nice hook. Yeah, this is a very nice case. I'm glad I bought it. Thanks everybody for watching.